What's up, everybody? Uh, opening day coming up, and uh, because the Mets are off, guess who decided to stop by? Big JD, two-time Cy Young. Gonna miss him on Thursday. Anyway, uh, day seven coming up. It's been great. Uh, heard from a lot of different uh, players and coaches, uh, former players. Uh, most, mostly everybody breaking my chops, but that's all good. And uh, today would have been facing Matuch in high school, Elizabeth facing uh, Coach Leo Danik's group and uh, Maddie Rowe, Rutgers commit. Uh, we miss you, Maddie. Would have been nice to uh, square off against you. Our boys were looking forward to it. Looking forward to a lot of things that haven't happened, but you know, um, everybody just trying to stay positive. Day seven drills coming up. Look forward to seeing you guys soon. All right, so this is a crisscross drill. If you notice, his hands are crisscross. He's gonna take a normal swing as if you were on a tee, but now we've crisscrossed his hands. It's going to feel very awkward for your player. But everything's the same. He's still trying to work middle. We want to emphasize he should have a lower base, still holding his finish. But it's awkward because we've taken his top hand and put it where his bottom hand is. After we give him about five swings of that, the result or the objective is that we're actually, OK, go ahead, normal. The objective is hopefully that he feels his hands much quicker. It's the equivalent, and you can see it, just by the way the barrel comes through. It's the equivalent of giving a kid 20 pound dumbbells, telling them to do arm curls, and then saying, okay, here, take this five pound weight and lift this as fast as you can. It's over recruitment of the muscle. The muscle knows how much to recruit.